Don't forget to smash that like button. Subscribe to the channel. And remember guys, this is for adults. Guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. Find all the photos that you want of these videos. What's up, you guys? This is Zach Jack Dan back with another Every Marvel Legends video. This time we're talking about every aim or advanced idea mechanics figure. First time we see an aim soldier is in the Mandroid Build a Figure series. This was the Captain America Wave. And he was the alternate of the Baron Zemo figure. The next one we see is a fan channel exclusive two pack with the AIM Scientist and the AIM Trooper. Allows you to swap out the head, the part, the gun, the backpack in order to make whatever kind of armor you want for the AIM. Next we have the Hasbro Pulse exclusive Army Builder for the aim trooper here gave us a little bit cheaper way to army build maybe of course modok is a member of the aim so i'm going to put them in this video and he was a builder figure back in toy biz days there were a lot of variants in this particular wave a lot of rare variants like that wasp was wet pretty rare the blue one Next, they talked about the Bring on the Bad Guys wave, which we already knew about Arcade and Little Mamu. So here is a teaser that they gave us for what it's going to be. We already know that we're able to build the army of the AIM soldiers by going to Hasbro Pulse and grabbing those guys up. And then they showed us we will be getting the Scientist Supreme as our third reveal from the Bring on the Bad Guys wave. Still don't know anybody else and don't know who the build figure is going to be. So next, we had teased us a while back with this image right here in front of the AIM Scientist Supreme. Of course, we all knew it was MODOK. So it is a deluxe MODOK figure, about $50 for this figure, and it comes with a closed box. I could not do an open box with this guy. It just wouldn't fit. There's the back of your package. And he is eight and a half inches tall sitting on that blast effect. They showed you the comparison of the size of him beside the AIM scientist there in that picture. And this is cool. He does have two different facial uh, features. You just pop that face right off. So that's pretty cool. Get out there and get your pre-orders on this as well. And there is Dwight popping that face sculpt off so you can see how it works. So really excited about this. I know that uh, some of you probably don't have that Toy Biz Builder figure. I do. Uh, I'll show you in a comparison here in a second. But, uh, this is a really cool deluxe figure. And there's the different poses with the different mouths and also the back of the figure. And here is your comparison between the Toy Biz and this new Hasbro deluxe figure. So I will say with Hasbro, it does not have the paint detail that the Toy Biz did. And I know, in my opinion, those crazy lips that the original Toy Biz had uh, was what made that for me. So let me know what you guys think about the difference if you enjoy the Toy Biz better or if this Hasbro Deluxe figure is so much better than Toy Biz. Let me know in the comments. There is the aim that we've had from Marvel Legends. There they are in package. I'm also going to kind of touch base on some people that have been members of aim. I'm going to go with Baron Strucker here in the Toy Biz 2 pack of the Face Off series. It's just a variant figure with the maskless Captain America. Also, Taskmaster has joined AIM several times. He was the Minister of Defense. Yelena Belova is also the Minister of State at one time.
Bane employed Batrock the Leaper to recover an explosive compound called Inferno. And here's my wish list or most one on this for what I'd love to see done by Marvel Legends for AIM. I'd love to see a super adaptoid. That would be amazing. Uh, you got Mo Dam, the female Modoc. And you got the Scientist Supreme, Monica Rappaccini. And then you also got the Ultimate Cat, um, Mr. Fantastic, which his name is Maker. So I'm going to jump over into the U.S. Avengers or the New Avengers. Whenever they bought AIM. And they renamed it America Idea Mechanics or Avengers Idea Mechanics. Sunspot, the Virtue of the Cop, the So first thing we saw in the Rocket Raccoon Build a Figure Wave this Hawkeye figure. We also, in the Young Avengers box set, got Wiccan and Hulkling. We got a Squirrel Girl in the Legendary Rider series. White Tiger came in the Rhino Build Figure Wave. Songbird was in the Thanos Wave. Cannonball, we've had a couple of. Came in the Wendigo wave and came in the two pack that was a Walmart exclusive with Domino. So there are all of the American or Avengers identity that they have made. And here's a wish list for most one of us, but the good guys. Is that Pod or Enigma? We got Robert Maverick as the Red Hulk. Sunspot, which is the Supreme Leader of Berto da Costa. And then Dr. Tony Ho. She's in the Iron Patriot armor. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave me a kind of comment. Hit that notification bell so you're aware of any new videos that I have. Subscribe to the channel if you already. Hit that thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later. Hey guys, don't forget to check me out on Instagram, Twitter, Pinterest. You can find all the photos that you want of these videos.